Larry Gadon, tinanggalan ng lisensya bilang abogado ng Supreme Court. Bago tayo magpatuloy, pakilike ang video na ito bilang suporta sa aking channel. Maraming salamat! Si Lorenzo Larry Gadon, ang bagong hinirang na presidential advisor para sa poverty alleviation, ay tinanggalan ng Korte Suprema ng lisensya ng abogado. Nagsimula ang problema noong minura ni Gadon ang isang reporter. Noong ikadalawamputwalo ng Hunyo taong dalawang libot dalawamputatlo, nagpost ang Supreme Court sa opisyal nitong Facebook page na nadisbar si Gadon. Bahagi ng post ng SC, published as is, Court unanimously disbars attorney Lorenzo Larry Gadon for misogynistic, sexist, abusive and repeated intemperate language. By a unanimous vote of 15-0, the Supreme Court and Bank resolved to disbar attorney Lorenzo Larry Gadon for the viral video clip, where he repeatedly cursed and uttered profane remarks against journalist Raisa Robles. The court had motu proprio taken cognizance of the video clip and issued an earlier order of preventive suspension from the practice of law against Gadun pending a judgment in the case. The court found the subject video clip as indisputably scandalous that it discredits the legal profession. In particular, the court cited Gadun for violating Canon 2 on propriety of the Code of Professional Responsibility and Accountability, which imposes the standard that a lawyer shall, at all times, act with propriety and maintain the appearance of propriety in personal and professional dealings, observe honesty, respect and courtesy, and uphold the dignity of the legal profession consistent with the highest standards of ethical behavior. The court pointed out that, Gadun unfortunately failed to realize that lawyers are expected to avoid scandalous behavior, whether in their public or private life. Sa isang pahayag, sinabi ni Gadun na magsasampa siya ng motion for reconsideration. Aniya, my remedy and reaction to this is to file a motion for reconsideration, on the ground that the penalty is too harsh for the alleged cause which was my outburst against a reporter, who was blatantly spreading lies against President Bongbong Marcos, during the campaign period intended to fold the public on issues, intended to cause damage to the candidacy of President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. Dalawang araw matapos pangalanan ng Malacanang si Gadun bilang Presidential Advisor for Poverty Alleviation, siya ay tinanggalan ng lisensya. Sinabi ni Gadun na ang desisyon ng SC ay hindi makaapekto sa kanyang bagong tungkulin sa gobyerno. Aniya, the position and the task given to me by the President, do not require lawyer ing hence my suspension and disbarment have no effect on my appointment. I will just approach this issue on a personal concern, file a motion for reconsideration and proceed in facing the challenges of the job, and aim to serve the public in my best capability. Kung nagustuhan nyo ang video na ito, pakihit yung like button. At huwag kalimutan mag-share at mag-subscribe. Salamat sa panonood.